Hampshire. Oh, you got to say that one again, because I don't think I got that. Megan from New Hampshire. Where? New Hampshire. <laughs> <laughs> Way over where there's trees and green stuff. <laughs> Slam. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, my mother-in-law was saying the other day, she's like, oh, you know, I don't know why people want to live where there's all those trees, because here you can see for miles. <laughs> if only there was something to look at. <laughs> So you're not going to be a spokesperson for the Las Vegas. <laughs> no, we used to we used to live out here, so it was it was all good. But uh, but anyway, I got the surgery because I just want a better life. So I'm glad it's done. But um, I don't know. I, I've had uh, a little bit of pain, but not too much. Mostly, I, I kind of felt like I was like, pregnant. And I was, that was very disturbing. I didn't want to feel that. I have five kids, so that was enough. <laughs> so I was glad when that feeling went away. And, and, uh, and I, the last couple of days, I've just felt normal. I said, turned to my husband and said, look at me, looking like walking like a regular person. <laughs> you know? So you can tell a like difference in how you walk? Or? Yeah, definitely. I, well, just I feel normal. You know, I mean, so a couple of times I'm like, oh, yeah, there's a staple there. Yeah, I feel that. And, but other than that, it's, I had a low-grade fever one night. My right. joints were kind of achy. But, uh, so we called Dr. Rutledge. He's like, you know, if you read the manual. <laughs> 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 but, uh, but that resolved itself the next day, right. and I just felt good. We went and saw a movie, and we saw the bodies exhibit at the Tropicana. That's really cool. Your job looks hard if you go see that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was. They have this one with the the stomach and the bowels all laid out, and I'm like, count off because I had an eight foot bypass. I'm like, count off eight feet. You know, that's an amazing amount of of. Of gut that's no longer yeah. going to be absorbing any groceries. Yeah. Like, wow, that's just incredible. And you know, I was also thinking, you know, right now there's not a lot of payoff because here I'm, we're sitting at the at the at a Italian restaurant waiting for our movie because we went and saw the Born uh, Ultimatum. What do you, What do you think? Uh, of the movie, movie? Yeah, oh, it star. was good. Okay. It was good. I'm a fan, though, so it was good stuff. But it's, here's my husband has a big plate of spaghetti and meatballs and a Caesar salad, and I've got green tea with lemon. I've got lemons on a plate with some salt because if you dip your finger in the lemon and then the salt, that tastes really good. <laughs> and and I was like, you know, there's not a lot of payoff because you know you can't go to the wine tasting and you can't go to the you can't eat the big meals, and you don't really feel like getting out and getting around, and you're still fat. And you're like, you know, there's got to be a better payoff down the road. So. <laughs> but I, I know there will be, and today is a much better day. So. Uh, cranberry juice. Oh, the cranberry juice. Two tiny little sips of cranberry juice, and oof. That was okay bad. With you. Did not agree. Mm -hmm. No more cranberry juice. Now, you talked about two experiences, and I want to point out that those experiences are for four days post-op, and things are going to change. So lemons and salt are not what you're going to live on for the rest of your life. In other words, we predict in your future, a year from now, and we have some of our patients who are longer out who comment on that, maybe it'll be interesting. There's steak, and there's salads, and there's uh, Sandy's latest favorite, which is pineapple upside down cheesecake from the Cheesecake Factory. <laughs> so all those things are in your future, but they're all in moderation, and they're all for the new, healthier, and thinner you. And try cranberry juice again. Yeah, because I will later. It believe just, me, it, it yeah. changes. Yeah. Plus, I was just really thirsty, because it's really hard to find things that tasted good. Water was just really bitter. And I finally found a guava pineapple juice that was just excellent. It's like all I drink now. It's really good. Well, that's going to change. Yeah. <laughs> all right, good. Do you remember how many minutes your surgery was? What did we say? It's like 40 or something. 40 minutes. Part. Okay. Looks good. They're healing up well. So we say on the shooting range, nice grouping. <laughs> <laughs> so, do you do a little shooting? I've been once. It was good. Okay, applause. Now I think oh no one